If you don't have tons of money to turn a room into a vocal booth for recording voiceovers and singing, will just using a blanket work if you like hold a blanket on top of you? Let's find out. Okay, so I'm standing about six inches away from the mic and I'm talking and this is what it would sound like if I were doing a voiceover just in a smallish room without any acoustic treatment or anything. So there's like um, reverberation and echoes and stuff as I talk. And this is what it sounds like um, being about six inches or so away from the microphone with a blanket over me. Um, likely you won't be hearing any reverberation or echoes or at least it'll be a lot uh, less. So it sounds a little bit more like I'm in an acoustically treated sound booth or something like that. It's just kind of tiring holding up this blanket. <laughs> this is what it sounds like to sing with and without a blanket sound booth. It feels like we forgot everything. It feels like we forgot everything. Okay, so it does actually work to use a blanket as a sound booth. Um, of course, you have to be holding it up the whole time, so it's kind of uncomfortable. It gets kind of hot in there fast. It's not very practical, but the point is it does work, so if you want to try that route, go for it. Or if you want, you can just try using your closet, like open up your closet doors and put the microphone kind of tucked into the clothing and, and sing into that. That seems to work pretty well. Um, and that's it. Bye.